So what we're doing right now is we're going to take a quick look at the WinRE or the Windows Recovery Environment GUI console. It's hard to imagine what some of these tools look like, so we're just going to take a quick video look at the console menu. And there are several ways to get to this tool. The one that we're going to use is by using the shutdown menu command. So as soon as I log into my virtual machine here, we're just going to go to a command window and we're going to use shutdown to kick off the WinRE or the Windows Recovery Environment console. And there's a new switch in shutdown that was not there prior to Windows 8 uh, Server 2012. It's the slash O switch. So if you're looking at websites about what all the switches are that are related to shutdown, a lot of them are dated and don't show the O switch. And the slash O switch is the one that allows you to get into the advanced boot options menu and restart the computer. Um, I don't really know why it's called O, but it is. So we're going to do slash reboot slash O slash time, set the time to zero. And then as it shuts down, it's going to start the Windows RE console menu to let us pick what we want it to do when it reboots. So right now we can turn it off. We can change our mind and just go back to the OS or we can go into Troubleshoot here. And in Troubleshoot, you can set startup settings, which is similar to the options that you would normally see in an F8 menu but you can choose them now prior to the reboot in case you're going to get some coffee and you don't have time to stand around and try to catch it during the boot menu. You can select those options here. You can go to a command prompt or you can tell it I want to reboot and look for a system image recovery or a recovery image that I previously had created with Windows Backup. So we're going to choose that option it's going to shut down and now when it reboots it's going to automatically boot into the WinRE console and search for a recovery image and it'll let you search network locations too so it's booting with network it will have us log in and then we'll be able to select the recovery image that we want to use and it will start scanning and try to find one locally on this particular VM I have multiple drives so the backup is on a non OS drive and it should be able to find it. So now it's scanning for images. Bam, there's the image that I had already created. If we wanted to look at a alternate network location, we would choose this radio button, we would go to next. It might have multiple ones showing up here locally or we can go to advanced and search on the network or we can install a driver if we need to to access some sort of attached storage but for right now if we selected this we'd be doing a bare metal server recovery using this systems uh, image backup which includes system state and all the required uh, pieces to do a bare metal recovery but we're not really going to do that. We're just going to cancel and do continue. It'll go back to the regular OS. So what we've looked at is simply a quick look at the WinRE console menu and how to get to that menu by using the new shutdown switch, which is the slash O.